What's going on, everybody? Will with Tangible Triumph, life, inspiration, motivation. Hopefully you're soaring into the week on the right foot. Over this weekend, we had a great podcast, great discussion on Soar Into the Week, episode 33. So, you know, we're staying consistent, we're doing our thing, and hopefully you're following along and improving every day, just like everybody on the Team Tangible uh, team is doing themselves. I jumped into a little bit of a topic over the weekend in the podcast, and I want to expand on that a little bit this week. I might have talked about it before, but my understanding of it is evolving every day, and I'd like to take you on a journey with me. Now, judgments distort the rational thinking mind. We have judgments about ourselves, the world around us, and judgments on just about everything that we deal with on a daily basis. Now, hear me out. When you start to label things, you start to separate yourself from those things that you're labeling. I was talking about it to somebody yesterday. You can look at things from a perspective of as it is or what you think it is. And when you start to form that opinion and you build upon that, You create a divide somewhere. In almost milliseconds, you can create a rational thought and turn it into an irrational thought. With that being said, put yourself in a position to where you can withdraw yourself and not necessarily give in to all these preconceived judgments. Because once you start to judge things, you stop yourself from ultimately being able to grow. And you put a roadblock in front of yourself to where you can't understand things around you and how they work. Reality is just that. It's real. And sometimes you give yourself the ability to block out what is real based on the judgments that you have on things, right? Set yourself apart from that belief system. We all have our belief system, and that's okay. It's fine to stick by that. But when you look outside of your belief system and start to judge people, whether it be based in relationship, people that you're involved with on a daily basis, or even situations that you may end up in, you close yourself off to opportunity. You literally build a wall around yourself to where you cannot form any other thoughts besides the ones you're thinking. And that halts any growth or possibility of becoming anything greater than you already are. We all operate on our own level of thinking. Each person we encounter is living their own life. So let's say I wake up in a bad mood today and I'm treating people differently than I normally would. Some people might not know me well enough to know that generally speaking, I'm a good, wholehearted person. So the people that don't know that may jump to the conclusion that I'm just an asshole. Which, on my part, that's okay. I probably am being one. And that's up to me to decipher and figure out and step back from. So if I'm tired, I need to go take a nap or do better at making sure I'm well rested. It's a tricky situation and a funky one to deal with. It's hard to try and insert yourself into any situation at any given moment, but you can project out and and try and understand how you can help and stop those thoughts in their tracks so that you don't proceed forward with this negative thinking and turn it into a positive, rational thinking mindset. Think about it this way. When you tell yourself, no one likes me because blank, blank, blank. Or, I'm a reject of society because blank, blank, blank. Well, when you begin to do that, you create that divide. So, as soon as you label yourself as something, you're actually doing the counter to what you think should be done. Nobody likes me because I like to read and don't really like to be around people. Well... How does that make any sense? If you like to read and don't like to be around people, but yet feel like a reject of society, 
Where's the problem? I personally think the problem starts here. Because if you want to be accepted by society, it's up to you to develop those relationships. And I'm here to tell you that you can do it. Take life and matters into your own hands. Try and be the best person that you could be on a daily basis. And do everything you can to put your, your judgments to the side because they'll distort your rational thinking mind. With that being said, get out there and do the best you can today. And be the best version of yourself. Because you deserve it and so does everybody else. With that being said, all rivers lead to the same ocean. Just don't swim upstream. Have a great week, everybody. Peace.